Welcome, Cancer. We are going to jump right into your reading. Find out what is happening with you, Cancer Collector. All right. Hmm. All right, we have the Four of Diamonds here. There is something that you hold near and dear with the Moon card. Maybe there is a little confusion. If not, there is a lot of change. There could even be savings for marriage here. Gifts. June 12th to the 18th, Father's Day. There is some kind of guidance here that you really need to listen to. That something inside of you right now, Cancer, has been trying to tell you. With the three of club here, there is some kind of planning. If not, uh, traveling that will be taking place. There's something that you are holding in, a desire. There's something that you want to buy here. Something you can see, feel, or touch. I'm feeling uh, even bits of organized chaos right now. Almost like you're so close to like what you want. But you're going to have to kind of like cut out certain people, places, and things to actually achieve it, your ultimate goal here, and how or where or what, well, the moon card here does tell me that you might somewhat feel split apart about what direction or where you were going. Feel spirit has brought in some healing for you as well, Cancer. So you could be coming out of a time of really any type of healing. More physical here with the Four of Diamonds. Music, song, dance, and play. But overall music here with the Moon card. So you could be listening to the radio and traveling, these kind of things. But at night, maybe uh, you might be hearing some concerts lately. Some of you cancers could be attending a concert. The King of Diamonds. There's a mount of controlling your feelings, but still the comfort here. The, the very nature that you embody itself of your comfort at home with the ones that you love here Everyone well taken care of. Responsibilities. The King of Diamond. There is someone here that you would do anything for long term. Long term. This is like a can do, go getter type of attitude here. And that three of club tells me that there is just this drive inside of you. I mean, I, it wouldn't be hard for you to get all these lavish things. Very loving energy. But still there's something you're holding in here. Something cancer 
you are holding and through all that you are doing for someone else. Something still pierces your soul. Have agony, have hope. Have agony, have hope. The Ten of Spades tells me that there is something that does just confrontation or just anything that makes you feel detached. Perhaps somebody said something to you, some kind of confrontational situation. And with the five of heart and the ten of spades, you aren't going to deal with this type of mental, physical strain in a relationship. Turning on the radio, cleaning the house, taking care of yourself. These kind of things is beautiful. Right? Taking care of the home front. Just you you are your best self. This is where you are able to in with the ace of spade here, this tells me that you have a lot of air in your chart as well. Technology, these kind of things could be really heightened in your life right now. Gaming significant. But the ace of club tells me Some of you have had to be very strong through a very trying time here, Cancer. It looks as if maybe your partner has seen that agony within you. There is something very romantic coming in, very, very special. But it's still re repressed within you. Running from these things that have caused your agony. I feel like someone around you really does understand here. There's confusion. There's confusion here with the teapot. Regarding this opportunity. Perhaps if some of you stand up and actually say something, you maybe are afraid that they would run away. I almost see with this three of clubs, something's like, my heart bleeds for you. You know, like I, like I understand. I've been through it, but you know, it been through a lot. I mean, to get here with this, this King of Diamonds, been through a lot of things here. The Moon card, your, your card itself, with the Eight of Hearts. This is big. Capricorn energy with the King of Diamonds. just brings up perhaps issues. Bigger issues with authority with the strength card here. You're really going to have to look and listen. Look around you. Take a look. I sum it adding up. It's not adding up. It's not right. What can cancer be doing 
at this time to better their life or achievement and success. What does Cancer need to know? Stay tuned to the end of this reading. I really hope this helps you. Check your Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising Astrological Placements to better understand a more in-depth reading, more personalized for you by doing that, by checking your chart aspects. And I'll, I will teach you a little bit more on uh, why things are this way. It, just by spending time with me on my channel, you are actually going to learn a few things. You know, I'm learning YouTube and I am learning uh, to be a tarot reader in the astrological community. It is new to me. I might have been, I have been doing this for years now on YouTube. Uh, starting out as a small channel, but I'm learning, just like you're learning, some of you. So, uh, I'm going to have to start telling you why maybe some things are the way they are. All right. Perfection here. Some of you got to understand, you don't have to be perfect to start something, to achieve something. You are enough overall. If you have to ask for help, remember sometimes that's what spirit has taught us to do is to humble ourselves and ask for help i feel like some of you are just in a very emotional time or somebody has seen you just go through it and try to perfect whatever you are going through now it's time to celebrate here that's what these two aces are about here when i see two aces i'm telling you there's a whole lot of excitement about to happen for you don't run from these things you deserve it you are enough improve your finances here and i see with the celebration card there is an unforeseen increase in your income some of you are wine drinkers so Perhaps maybe it's time to even t slow things down a little bit with that four of diamonds. You know, you've you've considered or have accomplished much. Maybe it's it's time to take a step back and um, celebrate a little bit. But with this uh, unforeseen increase in your income, you're going to need to look at your financial situation from a new perspective. There's going to be resources that you have remaining, and then there are going to be, you know, somewhat something, maybe a fear of failure here as well. But know that you have accomplished things. And you're going to accomplish so much more. And I feel like with a king of diamonds, there is some kind of earth sign around you. And perhaps you see them that they are needing help. Perhaps someone around you is really emotional. And you just being better in yourself and being a wonderful example, this is how you help others. So... Now with the hanged man, I feel like you're going to surrender. Maybe take time to read a book with that ace of heart. This this is this is definitely a wonderful time to maybe detach from the crowd, work on yourself, have a lovely date time, you know, with your partner. Show your partner the ropes, let your partner actually romance you under the moon. Overall, sometimes asking for help humbles you. Don't forget that it can humble you. And that is super, super important here. What kind of chakras can we get into alignment for the Cancer Collective? 
the chakras in alignment. What does Cancer need to know? The solar plexus. Yellow is wonderful. That buttery yellow color. Solar plexus colors. Colors. Yellow. Um, yellow. It's, it's to help you connect with the fiery energy. Try sun salutations. Boat pose. It's also uh, great for strengthening the abdominal muscles and balancing digestion. You know, wonderful, wonderful way to put yourself in alignment there. And as well as the root chakra. It's located near the perineum and it's established us on this earth. All right. It is super grounding. It is associated with grounding, uh, deepening and connecting to the environment. With that king of diamond, it is very important to strengthen that root chakra as well. Uh, some of you could be having some uh, abdominal or uh, digestion issues. It's important before you go out on a date or anything like that, that you take care of yourself. But there is celebration here. You don't have to be perfect to attend it. I see some of you even getting dressed up, really nice necklaces, matching earrings. Don't put a, some of you could be receiving a title for something. I see that as well here. Pretty interesting. So, but there's something where you're going to have to just avoid any confrontation. Enjoy a good book or something. If you are single at this time, I I really do see like maybe there's an animal, two cats around you. And if you're not looking like the Empress, I wouldn't know, you know, just very, very beautiful energy to embody here. At the same time, guarded energy. So it's an, it's definitely important to get out and socialize. You don't have to deal with any kind of confrontation. But just to even take in some yoga classes as well here. Or asking someone how do you get into something to better your your education you don't have to be perfect to do um anything you just got to use your resources around you to get on it very very simple very beautiful reading sometimes i i get some not so good readings cancer I hope this helps and give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Right until next time.